Hello, I'm Brian Tracy and welcome to The Brian Tracy Show. We have a remarkable man today who performs a remarkable function in America and for you, your companies and your organization, Mr. Darren Johnson. Darren, welcome to the show. Thank thanks you for, very much for being here. Well, thanks for having and, me today. And I know a lot about what you do, but tell our viewers a little bit about what you do. Well, we help companies produce special events that reward and recognize employees and thank their customers, which in turn increases employee retention and customer loyalty. Wow. And how did you get into this kind of a business anyway? That was an absolute fluke. Uh, I got out of the Marines. I got a part-time job driving a truck, ended up working for the company for 10 years. And then 20 years ago, my wife and I started our own business, and we've been producing events ever since. Wow. And over what area do you produce events? What geographical area? From Vancouver to Bermuda to the Caribbean, Mexico, uh, North America. Entirely North America. Wow. I think the mission would be is to, is to teach as many companies as possible how to go about rewarding their employees and thanking their customers. Wow. Now, you've done some unique, different things in putting together these events. Can you tell us one or two things you do? Well, probably the most unique and the latest thing that I've done is built this event vehicle. It's called the Extreme Party Truck. And we take it to corporate events, and it's a complete mobile entertainment complex that has 12 TVs, monster sound system, kegerators, uh, all types of special event equipment that we take to people's offices, to hotels, to various venues. And I'm not sure uh, if the business model is, uh, is wonderful, but it's a, a great new uh, innovative product to you know, that I've launched on the special event market. Wow. Now, can you give me a, an example of a story of one of your clients or customers and what happened and they were happy? And um... Well, but there's probably a lot to pick from in, in that category. But I would tell you one of the most memorable stories that I was telling somebody the other day was we were producing an event for about 350 people out in the desert out in Arizona. And it had been very cold the last few days. And we were... I'll set the stage for how this event actually was laid out. There was a, a big area where the, uh, the dining tables were built around these fire pits, and there was a barn where we turned it into a Remington Museum. And then over this ridge, there was an area where we were doing a, a concert after dinner. So it was about 3 or 4 o'clock, and my clients had informed me that they were going to do a walkthrough during that time frame. So I'm just walking through the area, checking things out, and, and one of my staff calls from the barn and says, hey, boss, we got a problem in here in the barn. So I, I walk over to the barn, and there my staff people are kind of gathered in the corner of this barn, and there are these two big, fat rattlesnakes coiled up in the corner of the barn where this cocktail reception is going to be. So just about that time, I see my clients pulling in up by where the table setups were, and I told the staff, I said, you guys got to kill these rattlesnakes right now before the clients see this. And uh, there was two Indian uh, staff members that were working for us on this particular week. And they said, you can't kill those rattlesnakes. That's bad luck. That's a tribal no-no. And I told them in turn, I said, bad luck will be if you don't kill those rattlesnakes, we won't get paid this week. <laughs> so I said, I got to go meet the clients. You guys got to kill these snakes. So I go up to meet the clients. We're up there for five or ten minutes. I'm stalling. I'm looking down at the barn, waiting for the high sign. I'm talking about cactus and the sun. And so one of the clients finally says to me, Darren, let's go down to the barn and walk through the event like the guests would instead of wasting all this time up here in the driveway area. So I start walking down there, kind of dragging my feet. I finally, the staff come out of the barn, give me the thumbs up, and they walk out with a shovel and a garbage bag that had the snakes in it. So I walk in there, show the clients the barn. We go through the whole event. The walkthrough is fine. The event ends up going off fine. All night I had my staff with flashlights around the barn making sure there was no snakes came in there. But uh, when you're producing live events, you have no idea the things that you've done. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, how can people get in touch with you if they want to use your services? Well, they can go to my website at darrenwjohnson.com right. or they can call me at 352 242-3870. Wonderful. Well, thank you very much. Anybody who wants a, a really great event should call you anywhere in the country. Thank, thank you. you very much, Darren.
That's great. <laughs>